this is my intro. Hey, welcome to my channel. Ow. Welcome to my channel. Hey, Stingray72 here. That's all the introduction you need. Today I'm doing a countdown of the top 10, in the camera, 10 fast food french fries. Number one may surprise you. Surprise the hell out of me. Here we go. Counting from number 10 to number one. Number 10, McDonald's. I get it. McDonald's. Have you ever ordered a side of McDonald's fries and thought, why don't these taste like they used to? It's not all in your head. In 1990, McDonald's began using vegetable oil rather than beef tallow to fry their French fries. Okay. Although I do love a good French fry from McDonald's, I don't taste the difference. Um, their fries, fried and grease. I don't know. Number 10, McDonald's fries. Number nine, Five Guys, which is low for me because anyway, Five Guys. Uh, this one came as a surprise to the group of people of the taste testers. Five Guys puts a serious emphasis on fries at their restaurant. Here's the secret. Five Guys, five gri I'm going to start over. Five Guys French fries secret ingredient is that they're fried in peanut oil. I think we all know that. Nonetheless, number nine French fries, five guys. Damn, that's a tongue twister. Number eight, Culver's. I'm not sure of Culver's. There's not one in my area. Culver's offers crinkle cut fries with an option for fry sauce, which is a tangy mayo ketchup mix. Well, now we know the secret. Um, number seven, Chick-fil-A fries. I'm not really a fan of Chick-fil-A fries. I don't care how hot they are. I'll eat them because they come with a meal and because my hips don't lie and thick thighs save lives. Chick-fil-A, um, uh, the only restaurant on the list to offer waffle cut fries. If you prefer the size and texture of waffle fries, then this might be your favorite on the list. Plus, waffle fries are an ideal vessel for sauce. You ain't lying because they catch and hold everything till they drip through the holes. Now, when I do eat um, food at Chick-fil-A, my fries, I always get the uh, avocado lime ranch dressing. The bomb. I don't dip it in anything else. Anyway, number seven, Chick-fil-A. Number six, Popeye's. Their french fries are garbage. Like um, checkers or rallies or whatever. Anyway. Popeye's offers fries that are tossed in bold Cajun seasoning. I've never tasted it. I really enjoyed the flavor of these fries, but they were quite different from traditional fries, simply seasoned salt. Um, the portion size on the to-go bag is quite large. This must be a different neighborhood. Bottom line, if you like spicy fries, these are delicious. But for those people who prefer classic fries, other options on this list will satisfy your craving. I remember that um, Popeye's used to sell onion rings, and they took that, among other things, off their list. They no longer have corn on the cob, which was really good. They don't have the Cajun rice, which was really good. Oh, my gosh. Um, and they took onion rings off. If they took anything else off, I'm not sure, but those were my go-tos. But this isn't about onion rings. Um, it's about fries, and Popeye's is number six for the top ten fast food fries. Number five, Shake Shack. I've never been to Shake Shack. There is one near me, but I've never been. Shake Shack offers a deep crinkle cut fry with great texture. They also like that they came in a box and not in a bag. This technique helped to keep the, fr helped to keep the fries neat while traveling and also offered a place to put some ketchup for dipping. While they only enjoy these fries they were ordering uh, from Shake Shack, they're definitely going to order a shake in the future. This isn't about shakes. Bottom line, if you do order these fries, don't forget the Shake Shack cheese sauce. I have, a, I have an issue with cheese and sauce being, the same, being in the same sentence or being considered the same. Just, I don't know, melt the cheese. Cheese sauce makes me think that it's made to be a sauce with cheese flavor as opposed to melting cheese and it being a sauce. That's where my, my mind goes. Anyway, number four, KFC. 
I was surprised that KFC even offered fries. When I crave a bucket of fried chicken, the sides I want to mash potatoes and biscuits. That being said, the battered and seasoned fries were delicious. I like their potato wedges. They replaced the potato wedges with the fries. Trying to compete. You didn't have to try to compete. Bottom line. While I wouldn't normally order a side of fries from KFC, the outstanding texture and perfect seasoning make this option a strong contender for the top fry slot. But it only made it to number four. So there you have it, number four, KFC. Number three, Portillo's, or if I'm going to go Italian or Latin on it, Portillo. Um, this Chicago-based restaurant group offered the best crinkle cut fries. They were perfectly crisp and fresh tasting. Fresh tasting. Another colloquial that I don't like. Full of flavor. And uh, bottom line, if you're lucky enough to live near Portillo, it's definitely worth a stop. Maybe in when I'm up Chicago way, I'll try it out if I ever see it. Number two, Burger King. In the fast food battle between McDonald's and Burger King, there's no doubt who reigns supreme when it comes to French fries. The Burger King fries are superior on all levels. Uh, they were thicker cut, lightly browned and crispy, um, crisp up perfectly. If you have a taste for good old fashioned French fries, Burger King won't let you down. Bottom line, the fries are a must order. You can order a BK Whopper on the side though. I do like Burger King's fries. I like the thickness of them. Um, and I use it with that onion ring sauce. No ketchup. Ketchup is only from McDonald's fries for me and it has to be the ketchup that comes from McDonald's. I'm anal with that. Don't worry about me. Do your thing. Number one of the fast food. Let me go down the line. Number nine, uh, number 10, we had McDonald's. Number nine, Five Guys. Number eight, Culver's. Number seven, Chick-fil-A. Number six, Popeye's. Number five, Shake Shack. Number four, KFC. Number three, Portillo's. Number two, Burger King. And the number one fast food french fry is Wendy's. The honor of best overall french fry goes to Wendy's. These fries are made with unpeeled potatoes, which are so much better with potatoes on than any other fry, and it's great for the texture. Okay, so while dipping fries in a Wendy's Frosty is optional, it's highly recommended. Let me tell you something. I wouldn't do that. Um, I, per I like salty sweet, but I don't like hot cold. And nothing is worse than cold french fries. I don't do reheated fried foods. It loses its zing. Um, nonetheless, there's the list. They say that Wendy's is number one. They say Wendy's outbeat all the others and it even outbeat McDonald's. I don't agree with that. Um, but there's your list of the uh, top 10 fast food French fries according to a list that I found on msn.com. The uh, link to this study will be in the description box below. My name is Stingray72. I thank you so much for selecting this video. If you like more videos like this, of course you do. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And until the next video, goodbye. Thank you for watching. This is the end. Bye.